Stop, look, analyze, manage. Slam for life. JJ, told you a million times not to jump down the steps. Sorry, Dad. Now don't do it again, I mean. But I've I seen mean... you do it. What? But I've seen you do it. Son, don't do as I do. You do as I say. Okay? All right, I'll see you later. I hate to start the day off yelling at him. He's a good boy, but he's going to break his neck if he doesn't slow down and think before he acts. Maybe I was a little hard on him. Hey, good morning, Joe. Hey, Terry. You headed out early this morning. Yeah, not really. Ben left before me. He's uh, given the Slam Risk Program talks to the day ship. Well, that sounds good. Where are you going this week? Well, I started at Southern last week. And uh, i got to go to Ace Aggregates today. Got some paperwork to take care of. Well, don't let me hold you up. I'll see you when you get back. Okay, Terry. Have a good one. You too. See ya. Hey, Terry, you busy? Uh, it depends on why you're asking. What's up? Well, I boxed up all of last year's reports, and the boxes are so heavy I can't lift them. Everyone is left for the mines, and you're the only one here. Mm, that sounds like backache to me. Where are they supposed to go? Down in the storage room. Of the 160 accidents reported by MSHA employees last year, 33 of them occurred at the office. Nearly a quarter of these were lifting related. Well? Well, I was just thinking. We're trying to get miners to think through a task, to analyze the actions and consequences that might occur before they begin to work. We call it slam risk. Have you heard of it? Sure. All of these materials we gave to the inspectors to hand out at the mines. Yeah. But did you see me? I've got to lift a heavy box. And I didn't stop even one time to think about the risk involved in lifting that box. What risks? Well, lifting from a position like this is risky, especially with my back. But standing on a push cart that can roll out from under me isn't exactly safe either. Start over. What are you talking about? The SLAM program. S-L-A-M. Stop. Look at your area. Look. Look around you for hazards. Analyze. Analyze how you're going to handle the risk that are at hand. And lastly, manage. Take all necessary action to manage the hazard at hand. Okay, I kind of remember that from the folders. So what you did was stop, look, and analyze. How will you manage those boxes onto the cart? <laughs> Cute. Move the cart back. Now I have room to work. You have to lift a heavy box. Lift with your legs, not with your back. Keep the load close to your body. Keep your back straight. You've heard this a hundred times. Hey, you're right. Here, show me again. Cute. Stop, look, analyze, manage. So, Think of the SLAM program as a tool. Stop, look around, analyze the area and job to identify any hazards, and then manage the job correctly by eliminating, avoiding, fixing, getting help, or reporting any hazards. Like the sticker says, stop, look, analyze, manage. The more you use the tool, the more you develop your skill with it. Recognizing and managing a hazard is the first step to avoiding it. Well, thanks for your attention. Work safely. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Let's go back to work. While I'm here, Dale, I'd like to walk the conveyor. Sure, no problem.
think the safety program is going pretty well? It's going real well. Yeah, I, I, everything looking good here. It's, uh, oh, ah. Hey, are you okay? Uh, yeah, I, I think so. I, I just might have sprained my ankle. Of 37 of the 160 accidents reported by MSHA employees last year, over 23% were categorized as fell, slipped, or tripped. 23 of them occurred on mine property. Oh, man, I, I can't believe I didn't see that, especially right after telling them to, to stop and look for hazards. A safety director and an MSHA inspector, boy, we look like two fine professionals. Yeah. You got that right. <laughs> oh, man. Stop, look, analyze, manage. Yep, this is the one. Yep. Uh, you wrote this uh, for a broken seat belt latch, and uh, the belt was replaced uh, Wednesday afternoon at 6.15. Great. Well, let me check it out. Okay. Yeah, it looks good. All shiny and new. Good as new. Yeah, that'll take care of that one. Well, good. That's all of them then. Yep. All done. About a dozen accidents occurred last year while MSHA employees were mounting or dismounting vehicles and mine equipment. I told you a million times not to jump down the steps. But Dad, I've seen you do it. You know, you look like you had a vision up there. Well, more like a guilt attack, I guess. This morning before I came to work, I yelled at my son for jumping off the steps. I just about did the same thing myself. But you know, you'd have yelled at us for doing something like that. Yeah, I, I would have. You know, I gotta start practicing what I preach, at home and on the job. Hi, Dad. Hi, son. What's up? Nothing. Got something for you. Thanks, Dad. And I want to talk to you. Remember this morning when I yelled at you for jumping down those steps? Uh, yeah. Well, I want to apologize. Because I have jumped down those steps just like that, and that's a bad example. And you were right to remind me of that. So it's all right to jump down the steps? No, it's not all right. But you said I was right. No, I said you were right to remind me that I had jumped down the steps, okay? You were wrong for jumping down the steps. And taking shortcuts can get you hurt. And it can get me hurt, too. And you're young, you've got a long ways to go. So slow down and be a little safer, okay? Okay. I love you. Love you, Dad. Now give me that candy bar. Thank you.